Hi there, I'm Pastor Delaney and it's week two of Lent. Today is Wednesday, March 8th, and we are continuing our journey through this season of streams in the desert with reflections on the phrase, I want to pray by faithful women from Wisconsin. This is a resource I received from a congregant and it's an old, uh, not too old, but older resource that still has a lot of really great stuff in it. So this reflection was written by Gail L. Heidke, who was a pastor at St. Paul Lutheran Church and ALC congregation in Beloit. She was ordained in 1980. I want to pray, Lord, have mercy. The words come as a refrain each time I worship. Lord, have mercy. They reappear almost routine, even when I'm tired, even when I have no other words to say, even when I cannot pray any longer. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Kyrie, it is our liturgical link to our heritage, our roots, our history to those of faith who've gone before us. It is our link to those around us and our neighborhood or around our world. Lord, have mercy. Mercy. What gentleness, what graciousness is being asked. Mercy. The feeling of compassion that begs an action. Mercy. In biblical usage, it shares the same Hebrew root as womb. It is a mother-like emotion. It arouses in me whatever maternal instincts I possess. With mercy, with gentleness, with compassion, a mother, a parent, regards her children, cares for them, nurtures them. Lord, have mercy. I hear the pleading cry of a mother whose empty land and empty breasts can no longer feed her children. I pray with her. Her cry is my cry, for the hungry, for this my family. Lord, have mercy. It is a trusting word and a transforming word, a prayer word that demands my trust in our Lord's mercy and care and calls forth a transformation in me. It is a prayer for change in me, in my world. Lord, have mercy. Let my prayer become my action. Let my life flow with this refrain. Lord, have mercy. It is my morning prayer of hope. Lord, have mercy. It is my noontime prayer of encouragement. Lord, have mercy. It is my evening prayer of peace.